and the Taylor Swift concerts are not the only reason that you might find big crowds this weekend at CVG. Yeah, and Raven is back with some ways that you and your family can avoid some long lines, some frustrations at the airport ahead of 4th of July. Raven. Yeah, it's going to be very busy. CVG could be a victim of its own success. In addition to the usual boost in passenger volume throughout the summer, airport officials say expanded air service into Cincinnati and two new airlines touching down this year is adding to those long lines. So CVG is estimating more than 350,000 passengers from Thursday, June 29th through Sunday, July 9th, which is the highest volume on Thursdays and Fridays. The busiest time for departures is 6 to 8 a.m. and the busiest times for arrivals 3 p.m. to 10 p.m. Officials say you should arrive at least two hours early for domestic flights and three hours early for international flights. If you're hitting the roads, AAA says you can expect a record number of drivers over the holiday. They're asking you to be on the lookout for emergency roadside workers. It's so important that everyone obey the move over laws which require everyone to slow down and move over one lane away from emergency roadside workers. And it's not just AAA drivers. It's firefighters, police, emergency medical personnel, construction workers, anyone trying to do their job at the side of the road. And something else both CVG and AAA suggest is check the weather. Of course, we know there's some thunderstorms coming and they're popping up all over the place. So no mm -hmm. matter where you're coming from, that's one thing you definitely need to do. Yeah, and not just here. Mm -hmm. It's not our weather necessarily yeah. hey. because all of a sudden you get there two hours early and find out you really are five hours early because your flight's delayed where you're going. Yep. Yeah, something to keep in mind yeah. for sure.